Okay, our next game will be game 12 of Family Feud PC. Hi folks, two choices. Okay. Backstage, all right. How many fa Pick your family. Family one, you have the space bar. Let's get at her. They're from Florida, and they describe themselves as being brilliant and poor. <laughs> Let's hear it for them. Family number one. They're from Olympia, Olympia. and they describe themselves as being solid and serene. Let's hear it for them. Family number two. Our two families will be doing battle for big bucks on the Family Feud. Here he is, the host of Family Feud, Louis Anderson. Welcome to another game of Family Feud, everyone. What are we waiting for? Let's get started. All right, let's start our first survey. You know the drill. There are hundred people right, the five of them on the Top board. Five answers up on the board. Good luck. Name something that people use on New Year's Eve. Your answer, family number one. Uh, noisemakers. Hope it's there for you. Let's see. Noisemakers. Noise the number one answer. Number one right. answer. Uh, I'm gonna Family pass. One. Are you gonna play or pass? Pass? All right then. See if I can get an idea for playing for family number two. Name something that people use on New Year's Eve. Taxi. Okay. Give me the answer. Uh, sorry, not on the sorry, board. Sorry, not on the board. Another player. Okay. Got an answer for us? Name something that people use on New Year's Eve. Fancy dress. Survey set. Nothing. Zero. Strike two. Uh, <coughs> oh, oh. oh. That's strike number two. two. Family number Might one. Number one. One, one more, more strike, strike and you're up. And we have a chance. Another player. We need another answer. Name something that people use on New Year's Eve. Answer, please. Champagne glass. I want to see that answer. Uh, oh, good answer, but sorry. The next family can steal. Okay, family number one. Name something that people use on New Year's Eve. How about... Huh. No. Confetti. Yeah! Yeah! Show me that. It's up there. Number four answer, but it's good enough for the steal. All right, family number one. You got the points. Let's see what was the second most popular answer. Champagne alcohol. Place? He said champagne glass. What was that in the fifth That should have counted. Oh, fireworks. Duh. brings us to the end of the first round. Let's look at the scores. Family number one, you're playing great. Family number two, you're not far off the lead. Okay, let's, let's move, move on, on to the, on next, to round. the next round. Come on, come on! Come on. Let's play round two of the, people survey. Of the family feud. The We're looking for the most popular answer. Good luck. <laughs> okay, four answers Name for the survey. Name something that's white and expensive. Uh Okay, family number one. Let's try white and expensive. Maybe a car? No. No, wine. Wine. No. Is it there? 
Show us. No, too bad. Family number two, you get a chance. What did they say? I didn't see it. Car. Oh, I was going to say that. That was the answer I had. That's right. Uh, good thing Family it's not number, number one. Are you gonna play or they pass? have the option to play or pass. Ooh. They're going to play. You're going to play? All right. Another player. Okay. Got what? an answer for us? Name something that's white and expensive. Um, I guess juice. Got an answer for us? White gold. Let's see if it's up there. Hey, name something that's white and expensive. Oh. Good guess, but no. I gotta give I you a work. strike. Another player. We need another answer. Name they something don't steal that's white it. and expensive. Come on, we need an answer. Okay. We need the answer. Wedding gown is up there, but it's not number one. Cars up there. Another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Name something that's white and expensive. Ivory, Survey somebody set. said. Ivory. Yeah, like ivory soap. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer, but it wasn't in our top four. Careful, only one more strike. Another player, we need another answer. Name something that's white and expensive. Good answer. A Good house. Answer. A white Good house. house. <laughs> it's not there. <laughs> Good guess, but no. Gotta give you a strike. A chance to steal coming up. Uh. What do you think it is, family number one? Name something that's white and expensive. Hmm. No. no. Well, I'll type in wedding dress, and if that's not, that's already called wedding gown. We already have that All answer right, up let's there. Try, try again, please. Jewelry. Let's get going. No. Is it there? Ran out of ideas. Uh, Family number two. You did it! Excellent. What was the number one response? Fur what was coat. It and fur coat and pearls. You gotta think fashion. brings us to the end of the second round. Let's check out the scores. Family number one, you are off to a great start. You're on the way back, family number two. Not for long. Let's move on to round Let's three. Let's move on to round three. I need a couple more players. A hundred people surveyed. We've got their top five answers up there. Good luck. All right, we got five for this survey. Name something that some women do in a very unladylike way. What do you think it is, family number one? Hmm. Dress. No. Strike. No, it's not up there. Over to family number two. Yeah. Okay. yeah. I knew the answer. That was my answer. Hi. Bottom of the survey. Good. Good, answer. Good answer. He said it. Number two. Are you gonna play or pass? Good answer. Good answer. You're playing? Okay. Another player. Okay. Got an answer for it. Play something that some women do in a very unladylike way. I want to see that answer. Good guess, but no. I gotta give you a strike. Another player. We need another answer. 
Name something that some women do in a very unladylike way. Answer, please. I want to see that answer. Strike two. Uh, good answer, but it wasn't in our top five. It wasn't five. in our top five. <laughs> Next family, get ready to steal. Another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Name something that some women do in a very unladylike way. Smoke. Yeah. Good answer. Good answer. Is it up there? Absolutely. Absolutely. Next family member, what do you say? Name something that some women do in a very unladylike way. Let's go. Bending over. Mm. I want to see that answer. Uh, up there. I gotta give you a strike. Next time, you can steal. Family number one. Name something that some women do in a very unlady. -like Swear. Way. Yeah. All right. Let's see. It's up there. We got not number one, but we got it. Curse. Okay. Give family number one those points. Boom. What was the number one response? Sit. What was the fourth most popular answer? Eat. Uh. <laughs> Not a lot of points there, but at least I finally got to hear. <laughs> I got. I finally got Let's to hear. Let's see how our families are Louis doing say, after round Good three. answer. Good answer. <laughs> Family number one, you are off to a great start. Family number two, you're not far off the lead. All right, it's time for round four. Let's find out who's going to play fast money. Fast money. I need a couple more players. A hundred people survey. Top Got four answers, answers for this board. survey. We're looking for the most popular answer. Good luck. <coughs> okay. Name a place people keep pictures of their spouse. Okay, family number one. Uh, in the kitchen. Well. Survey set. Too bad. Family number two, you get a chance. By the Got an answer for it? phone. No. Survey set. Nope, we're going to a new survey. Uh, <laughs> no, that's not it. Well, okay, that's then. not it. Let's <laughs> We surveyed 100 people. Top Another four, four answer survey coming up. Here we go. Name something you need to get into medical school. Um. Family number one. You need a degree. All right. College degree. Very good. But there's two up there that can beat it. Next family gets a chance. To give Let's go. up Down your social Here's life. Number two. What? I want to see that answer. Uh, good guess. But what? It's there. Family number one. Are you going to play a pass? Or Pass? All right. We're going to pass. Your answer. Name something you need to get into medical school. Money. Good answer. Good answer. Yeah, Good it's up. there. Number two. Oh, boy. Yes, indeed. You got it. <laughs> another player. We need another answer. Name something you need to get into medical school. Let's go. Put down something. Patience. I hope it's up there for you. It's not up there. I gotta give you a strike. Next time, you can steal. Your answer, family number one. Name something you need to get into medical school. Well, we lost. Uh, 
Tommy number two. Tommy number two. Ay, ay, ay. Who was the number one response? Let's Good see what grades. was in four. Intelligent spy. Let's go ahead and try another game. Let's check out how both families are doing after this round. Very well done, family number two. All of you played great. Congratulations, family number two. Come back again and see us on Family Feud. I'm counting on it. All right. Welcome to the Family Feud, folks. Okay. Adjust the game so you're ready. Right. All right. We're going to go right into the second game. Okay. For another stage. game. Let's start off. Pick game your 13. Family one, you have the space bar. Good, great, and intelligent. Let's do it. Come on. They're from Florida, and they describe themselves as being brilliant and full. Let's hear it for them. Family number one. They're from Olympia, and they describe themselves as being solid and serene. Let's hear it for them. Family number two. Our two families will be going battle for big bucks on the Family Feud. Here he is, the host of Family Feud, Louie Anderson. Time for the Family Feud, everybody. Let's have some good old-fashioned family fun. Good luck, everybody. A hundred people survey. Hot four answers are on the board. We're looking right, we for the most popular answer. got a four-answer survey for this one. Good luck. Name something that clogs your sink. What do you think it is, family uh, number one? Hair. Oh, I have a good feeling about this. Still me. me. <laughs> Hair. Hair. The number one answer, all right. Family number one, are you going to play or pass? We're going to play. Going to play? Let's gonna play. Go. Let's go. <laughs> Name something that clogs your sink. How about food? All right. Let's see what I'm yeah, it's there. That's right. Another player. We need another answer. Name something that clogs your sink. Hi. How about? No. Gunk. Is it there? Show us. Uh, it's not up there. Strike number one. Another player. Okay. Got an answer for us? Name something that clogs your sink. Cassava mucus. Is it there? Show us. Uh-uh. Uh, Good answer. Good but it wasn't answer. In our top four. Next family, get ready to steal. Another player. We need another answer. Name something that clogs your sink. Uh, what's clogging my drain? No. Uh, how about oil? No. Is it there? Yes. Uh, no. Good guess, but no. Gotta give you a strike. Oh. Our chance to steal coming up. Your answer, family number two. Chance Name steal. something that clogs your sink. Grease. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the they got it. Good. Yes. Family number two, you get the points. 
Uh, Let's see what man. was in four. Coffee grounds. That brings us to the end of the first round. Let's look at the scores. Very well done, family number two. Oh, we're family getting number to back one, for that. In striking distance. We'll get him. Let's move on to round two. A member from each family. Let's go. A hundred people surveyed. We've got their top five answers up there. Five answers for this one. Name something you hate to have even your best friend borrow. What do you think it is, family number one? A uh, car. Okay. okay. I want to see. Car. car. The number one answer, all right. <laughs> all right. Family number one. We're gonna pass. Are you gonna play or pass? Pass? All right then. Yeah. What do you think it is, family number two? Name something you hate to have even your best friend bar. BCR. Good answer. Good answer. Is that correct? Uh, sorry, not on the board. Sorry, not on the board. Next player, what's your guess? Name something you hate to have even your best friend borrow. Let's go. Put down something. Let's see if it's a uh, It's not there. Second strike. Next family. Get ready to steal. Next family member. What do you say? Name something you hate to have even your best friend borrow. I want to see that answer. It's not up there. I gotta give you a strike. Next family, you can see. All right. I think I got it. I got one. Family number one. Name something you hate to have even your best Their friend. Your phone. Oh! No, it's not there. Again, I failed. All right, family number two. You get the points this round. Was the second most popular answer. Clothes. Who was in third place? Toothbrush. What was the fourth most popular answer. What was Spouse. in the fifth <laughs> Definitely money. That's the end of round two. Let's see how everybody's doing. Hey, family number two. You've built up a big lead. There's a lot of game left. Hang in there, family number one. All right, it's time for round three. I need a couple more players. Come on, let's get a comeback here. Top four answers are on the board. We're looking for the most popular answer. Good luck. Name a button that everyone pushes several times when one pushes all that is needed. Uh, okay, family number one. Let's try. Cross button. Answer, street. Please. Crossing street button. Is it there? Show us! Uh, nice try, but no, sorry. Geez. Family number two, you give it a shot. Answer, please. I have to be more specific. Let's see if it's up there. I said street cross. Yes, indeed. All right. Family number two. Yeah, Are you you're not play being specific. Uh, gonna play. You gonna play? All right. Another player. Okay. Got an answer for us? Name a button that everyone pushes several times. When one pushes all that is needed. Come on, we need an answer. Good answer. Yeah, it's there. Yeah. Elevator. They're on the. They're on a roll. They're on a roll. The number one answer. All right. Another player. We need another answer. Name a button that everyone pushes several times. When one pushes all that is needed. Parents. Got an button. answer for us. Good answer. Good answer. Is that correct? Uh, 
<laughs> Another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Name a button that everyone pushes several times. When one pushes all that is needed. Doorbell. No. Let's see if it's up there. They're taking my answers. Alright. It's, it's Looks like I have to make a comeback in round. What's your guess? In the Name fast the money round. It looks like they're not they're not slowing down. Enter key. Survey set. Good answer. But sorry. Your second strike. Family number, number one. one. One more strike and you're <laughs> up. One more strike and we're up. Next family member. What do you say? Name a button that everyone pushes several times. When one pushes all that is needed. Got an answer for us? Intercom button. No. Okay. Give me the answer. There. Next family can steal. Family number one. Name a button that everyone pushes several times. When one pushes all that is needed. Uh, power button. Oh. Is Show us. I'm just out of ideas. Uh, family number two. You did it. Excellent. Is there anything that Let's can go my way? Four. Soda pop machine. That's it for the third round. Let's look at the score. Oh, yeah. You've got a commanding lead, family number two. All right, it's time gotta, for round four. Come, Let's find we out gotta get it. We gotta get it. Two more players two more and we can, we can get, get going. going. Let's do it. A hundred people oh, surveyed. Hundred people five surveyed and we have five answers. We're looking for the most popular answer. Name something specific you use every day. Okay, family number one. Um, toothbrush. I think care for you. Let's see. <laughs> toothbrush, paste. Toothbrush, paste. <laughs> Good answer, number one. Family number one, are you gonna play or pass? Hang on. No. You're gonna play. You're playing? Okay. Another player. You need another answer. Name something specific you use every day. All right. Oh, well, we just lost. No matter what happens. Good guess. Two in a row. Gotta give you a Just lost two in a row. What do you think it is? Nothing goes two? our way. Name something specific you use every day. Nothing ever, ever goes, goes our way. Good answer. Good well, answer. we did get the points that round, but not enough. Uh, All right, family number one. You got the points. What was in second? So. What was in third? Uh, what was the fourth most popular 24. answer? The fifth most popular answer. Well, it would have been close if I had I completed the survey. What? Nobody uses the bathroom every day? That takes day? us to the end of this round. Hey, let's check out the scoreboard. All right. Very well done, family number two. Let's try one more game. All of you played great. Congratulations, family, family number, number two. two beat See us you again. again on our next game of Family Feud. Goodbye, everybody. Welcome to the Fair Enough. Backstage, all right. How pick your family. Family one, you have the space bar. Let's get this show on the road. Well, I think I got that round. And they describe themselves as being brilliant and bold. Brilliant Let's and bold. For them. Family number one. 
They're from the Sunflower State. And they describe themselves as West <laughs> and Creative. Let's hear it for them. Family number two. These two families will be playing for FIFA on the Family Feud. And now, here's the host of Family Feud, Louis Anderson. It's time for another exciting game of Family Feud. You know the drill. You know the drill. You know the survey. Top five answers up on the board. Good luck. Name an occupation whose men have reputations for playing around. Okay, family number one. Athlete. All right. Let's see what's on the board. Uh, no, too bad. Family number two, you get a chance. Are these surveys making me clueless or what? Positions, come on. Why do we get the bad ones, but they get the good ones? My good. goodness. Good answer. <laughs> good answer. <laughs> At least I heard Family that. Two. Are you going to play or pass? <laughs> good answer. Good answer. Huh. Oh, they're going to pass because they're taking a while. All right, then. Family number one will play. Yeah. Family number one. All right. No. Musician. It no, it's not there. <laughs> not up there, sorry. You don't sound sorry. Next player, let's go. Name an occupation whose men have reputation for playing S around. Salesperson. All right. Let's see what's on the board. Uh, good answer, but it wasn't in our top five. No, it wasn't. Next family, get ready to steal. Next player, what's your guess? Name an occupation whose men have reputations for playing around. No. How about police officer? All right. Show me that. Is there anything on the survey? Uh, it's not up there. I gotta give you a strike. Next family, you can steal. Okay, family number two. Name an occupation whose men have reputations for playing around. Is there any answer that's good for me? TV Let's evangelist. Good answer. Oh, we good got answer. That Okay. Only seven points, but we got it. Uh, Family number one, you did it. Way well, to go. You did it. Way to go. What was the number one response? Se Let's see what was the Are you kidding me? I said salesperson. Answer. I gotta be less. What was in third? I was too vague. I mean, Let's see what was in fourth. I was too specific there. I said athlete and sales on there. And they were not acceptable, but sales and athletes were. That's the end of round one. What the one. heck? Let's see how everyone's doing. Good job, family number one. You've got the lead. Family number two, you're not far off the lead. Do I have the uh, spelling accuracy on? Come on, let's go. I need two more. Do I have the spelling here. accuracy let's on? A hundred people surveyed. We've got uh, their top five answers up there. Strict, maybe. I don't know. I don't think I do. Name a spot in your house that the kids think is a better place for their clothes than the... Your answer, family number um, one. Um, under the bed. All right. <laughs> yeah, it's there. Oh. Number two answer. Only one's going to be there. Next time. Lamps. I hope it's up there for you. Put it by your lamps. No. Uh, good guess, but it's not up there. Family number one, are you going to play or pass? We're going to play. 
You gonna play? All right. That's clear. Let's go. Name a spot in your house that the kids think is a better place for their clothes than the closet. Shelves. Is it there? Good answer, but no. Got to give you a strike. Next player, let's go. Name a spot in your house that the kids think is a better place for their clothes than the. Survey. Hope's not up there. It's not there. Second strike. One more strike, and you're up, family number two. Another player. We need another answer. Name a spot in your house that the kids think is a better place for their clothes than the closet. Uh. Oh, drawers. No. I hope, I hope it's there, come on. Answer. All right. It's the... I swear. Every single good answer I come up with. It's not there. Not good enough. According to the game. What do you think it is, family number two? Name a spot in your house that the kids think is a better place Without for their hesitation. clothes than the closet. A bureau. Okay. No. I need the answer. Another slow round. <laughs> Give family number one those points. What was the number one response? Or third place. Oh. In, what was the in the bed, bed post. Answer. Chair, the couch, post? bathroom. I was gonna say bathroom, but that wouldn't make sense. Who puts their kids That's on the, the end of round two? Yeah, Let's see how everybody's doing. I guess I must have been talking too much about adults. Well done, family number one. Family number two, you're not far off the lead. Round three, let's go. Let's, let's play. play. I need two more players up here. Let's go. Let's go. You know the drill. A hundred people did the survey. Top six answers up on the board. Good luck. Name something people sometimes crawl under. Your answer, family number one. Um, bed. <laughs> survey said. <laughs> yes, sir. Good answer, but there's one that can beat it. Next family. Sink. I hope it's up there for you. Good guess, but it's not up there. Family number one, are you gonna play or pass? We're gonna play. You're playing? Okay. Another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Name something people sometimes crawl under. Um, the couch. All right. Let's see if it's on the board. Sorry, not on the board. That's strike one. Another player. We need another oh, answer. Oh, obvious Name answer. Name something people A table. sometimes crawl under. This is not number one. But it's up there. Yeah. You got it. Next player, let's go. Name something people sometimes crawl under. No. The chair? Is it there? Show us! No, it isn't. 
Good guess, but it's not there. I gotta give you another strike. Family number two, one more strike, and you get a chance to steal. Next player, let's go. Name something people sometimes crawl under. No. Desk. All right. Well, we're not doing good here. There. I gotta give you a strike. Next time, will you can speak. <laughs> Family number two. Name something people sometimes crawl under. Yeah, oh, it's that. there. Crawl under the covers. All right. Give family number two those points. What was the we haven't even got a number response. one response for this third game in this the video. Under the car. Answer. Let's see what was in six. Crawl car house fence. That's it for the third round. Let's look at the score. They have the lead now. You're in the lead, family number two. Round four, points are tripled, but you only get one strike. Then, the other family gets a chance to steal. Let's play. I need a couple more couple players. A couple more players. A hundred people survey. We've got the top three answers. Three you answers for this survey. Them. Good luck. Name something that you buy by the dozen. Um. Your answer, family number one. Eggs. Oh, I have a good feeling about this. Show, Show me. me. Eggs? Eggs? <laughs> oh, you got it! Our number one answer! Family number one, are you gonna play or pass? I think we're gonna play. Just wanna make sure. No. Pass? All right then. Yeah. Family number two. Name something that you buy by the dozen. Cookies. No. I hope it's up there for you. Uh, juice. Uh, uh, sorry, strike one. Sorry, strike That's one. one. <laughs> can steal. All right, let's uh, do donuts. Family number one. Name something that you buy, you buy by the dozen. Buy a dozen donuts. Number one gets the point. All right, we finally third? got one. Golf balls. That takes us to the end of this round. Hey, let's check I out the scoreboard. I guess I can take Cranberry. Well done, family number one. I'm almost done. Nice work, everyone. Moving on to our fast money round is our top money winner, family number one. <laughs> Time to play fast money round. I need two people from your family. Let's go. We have our first player. Good luck. The clock won't start until I finish reading the first question. Name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine dramatically. Age. Besides hitting balls, name something baseball players do. Pitch. Besides butter, yeah. name a spread for bread. Um. Before and after. Yeah. Cream cheese. No. Je jelly. Name the age when people's sex drive dwindles. Hmm. How about fifty? How old is too old to go to a singles bar? Um, 60. Let's take a look at your answer. 
Name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine dramatically. You answered. Our survey said. Two. Besides hitting balls, name something baseball players do. Your answer was. Our survey said. Eleven. Besides butter, name a spread for bread. You said. Our survey said. Name the age when people's sex drive dwindles. Here's your answer. Our survey said. How old is too old to go to a singles bar? Your answer was. Was it up there? Not bad. Maybe 116 points. Our next player needs 120 points to win the fast money round and ten twenty thousand dollars. We now have our second player. Same five questions, looking for the most popular answers. Can't duplicate. The clock won't start until I finish the first question. I'm almost done. I'm on the final round. Name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine dramatically. A change, name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine dramatically. Oh, never mind. I... No. Uh, no. Name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine. No. Besides hitting balls, name something baseball players do. Besides butter, name a spread for bread. Name the age when people's sex drive dwindles. How old is too old to go to a singles bar? Let's see how you did. Name a change in your life that causes you to change your routine dramatically. Your answer was... Survey said... No, zero for bar. Besides hitting balls, name something baseball players do. You gave us... Show it to us. Four. Besides butter, name a spread for bread. Your answer was... Is it up there? 22. Name the age when people's sex drive dwindles. You answered. Our survey said. Our number one answer. How old is too old to go to a singles bar? Here's your answer. We got the number one answer for 60. Survey said. Short. See you later, guys, here at the den. That wraps up. I gotta eat dinner no, now. No, sorry, but nice try. You're still our winning family, though. Congratulations. Thanks so much for playing Family Feud. I really appreciate it. I hope you had fun. I know I did. Yeah. All right, so long, guys.